حماد الشيخ انت متجه للجامع الغرويين الان الشاب اللطيف يبيع احلى عصير تعال عند هذا المكان اين البلاصه اين البلاصه هذه الصفاح الصفاح شوف ثلاث دراهم قسما بالله احلى عصير تشربه انا شربته عنده واليوم عجبني قلت له كل شيء تكبر كل شيء ويبيع لك ايضا يبيع لك كلها يبيع لك كل هذه حتى تبيع اللوحات يبيع كل شيء هذا عندك سوق التباق اللي هنا والله شوف شوف ثلاث آه. دراهم والله مفروض ب 10 دراهم <تصفيق> وبارده ما شاء الله عليك براب هذه باب الفتوح اه اه ما شاء الله واعره واعره فاس واعره واعره ما شاء الله يبارك So we are going to explain to you what is mean the first university in the world and who made it, who did it. There's a girl called Fatima Al Fahri. That's her name. So we are going. We are fast at the moment. We are in Morocco, in a city particularly fast. The beautiful city, the first university in the world here, here in that world, in that place. A lady and her sister, they made it. Remember that place. Look at that. Look at that. Look how beautiful it is. ما شاء الله. Look how beautiful it is. Front end with mixed ceramic. Ah, bro, beautiful. I can. You speak English, my friend. Yes. Well done. Well done. What's your name? Zuhair. Zuhair, come to Zuhair. Give me your number. Give me your number. Zuhair Asatah. Okay, zero zero two one two. Give me your number. عطني رقمك. رقمي. ما عنده. He doesn't have a number. It's okay. Just you find him. He's the only good looking guys here. The most beautiful. It doesn't have a number, so when you come, guys, look after him. He can he can collect money and he can he make a number. Look how beautiful. Look at freedom, freedom of of freedom of sleep here in cat sleeping like peacefully here in in Morocco, Arab side. Who built that city? Dries, Ibn Abdullah, Ibn Hassan, Ibn Hassan, Ibn Ali, Ibn Talib. Who he came here, run away from Abbasi time. To skip from that war, to settle in this city, and he get married from a girl. Her name is Kenza Ibn Adris, or Bint Adris. Kenza Bint Adris. She came here. Khurof al Eid, Khurof al Eid, Khurof al Eid. Allah hi barak. Kal am tabkhir ya shabab. Allah rahmatik. So we are going to the university, the Finnish university. Ah, beautiful. They build the old-fashioned tradition plate. Zuhair, Zuhair. Place Rakta. of handicrafts. How beautiful! Look at his English. Look at his accent. That's why they choose the city because the water is like a 50, 50 barrel of water in here in that city in Fas. So that's why they start the first settlement in that city for the first state for the Islamic state called Adrisi State in that area. This, this is the area Andalus. Uh, this called this section is called Andalus. How the Andalus. Al -Andalus. The area, the monuments. Ah, oh, okay. five monuments. Ah, oh, okay. Monuments, the fountain. Fountains. The Quranic school. Oh, beautiful. The bakery where they make bread. Hammam. Ah, oh, look how they do. They do shower as well. The they do. ceramic. Okay. Place yeah. of the ceramic. Oh, area. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. They chose the city because of the water guys here. Look how nice it is. That's Inside good. the river uh -huh. is behind the river, the Karawin area. Ah, oh, behind the other side you can see the. Karawiyin, the villages people live on the other, other, other side of the city. Fresh water, huh? Fresh, huh? Yes. Fresh, you can drink from that water, guys. The way, guys, you can. when you go there, you can see all that section, guys, in front of you, how tradition, the cultures of Morocco. You see it here. You better take a tour, guys, with you, so you will be happy. And you were never lost. Remember that place, guys. That's the way to go to Jama'a, the University of Karawiyin. The first university. This is the place Safari. We the make Safar. Bro. Okay, that's how they make the steel here. Sell steel as well. So it's called Safarin Market. That's how they made this one. And that location, that place. The way to. It's a very tourist place. الجمعية المغربية غزّة صناعة تقليدية صناعة the old tradition they made everything here look everything they made by hand huh? look how beautiful look how Morocco traditional very very old traditional place it's been 1,200 years ago Dries came from Mecca to here and built his city we are close to the Ferris University.
from that way. Chinese. The door of Chinese. The first university was here, built here. Okay. And the mine. Okay. okay. The first university. University of villages or University of Garawiyin. Garawiyin has been villages. The villages people have been created and made and built by a lady called Fatima Al Fihri. She's originally from Quraysh, from Mecca. Her grandfather called Mr. Uqba ibn Nafa, who came, who came from all over the Arab side and he took over all the side of all Northern Africa. His name is Uqba ibn Nafa. Uqba ibn Nafa is a very famous man. What do you think you do? Before you go, take off your shoes. They put a gun for you in the bag. Alrighty? This is the first university in the world. It's been built by a lady called Fatima Al Fahri. And she inherited her house and she created the idea to make it as a school and university. The first, so that was the first university in the world. As you can see, it's a mosque. That's why they call it. Garawiyin University in here. This lady, by the way, it's been built, extended by a tribe called Zintan and other Murabutun and Mohadun. They extend it. There's a lot of people they come, took over this land and they extend it more and more so they make it become university and mosque in that place. They in fast. Ask for the first university in the world being recognized. The first university here. Look how beautiful place. It has a, you can study chemical, you can study engineering, math, science, you can study Islamic, you can study Arabic, other language. And by the way, not only, not only Arabs and Muslims, even Jewish and Christianity, they have right to study here. As you can see, people make a wudu. The way the water come from that come from the river underneath. Look at the way builder. Look how engineer 1,000 signs of the way they build it and the technician, the arts, the architects. Look at that. How beautiful. That's when in Europe they have no fresh water. In here they have a water, painting water. It's been built since 2,200 years ago the university the lecture was here here the lecturers that's how they study from that place you gotta come here visit and very safe place by the way still a lot of tourists they come to this place and to talk about it and start picturing that photo okay it's a lot of school a lot of classes here this place for lady to pray, but there's a lot of clothes, a lot of classroom here. They, you can, wherever you go, there's a classroom. Look how beautiful this. You can take a photo there. I'm up. Well, I have a Remember the word, remember who started the first university? That was an Arabs lady, a Muslim lady, Arabs. And she was wearing a hijab, huh? By the way. So do not tell me Arabs being a breast woman. Don't tell me Arab, they don't give chance to the woman. She was the teacher, she was the lecturer. She built that place, a lady, Arabs and Muslim lady. So open your eyes, come travel, and don't look at the media. See the truth of how Arabs and Muslim they give value for women and no one no one was no one was objected or reject the idea everybody supported by everyone she got the idea and she started and they built it and a lot of people helped her to build that place a lot of people donate money to help that place a lot of people they give hand to build that place the first university now call for prayer looks in how they call for prayer now mashallah it's a mosque, by the way. Mosque and university. That's why it's called Jama.
Start going to pray now. All people come to pray that Mecca that way. You have to face Mecca that way. Mashallah, the mosque is full. So, people just finish prayer now, as you can see. So, there's too many classes, eh? too many students, eh? and still, by the way, still this university still works, still exists, and still people come in from all over the world to study, and you can get a certificate from this university. So, it still work. Still some students, they come here to study around this area. But now it's a summer, it's a school holiday, by the way. But it's a tourist place, but at the same time, it's still a university. It still exists, and you can have a degree from this university, whatever you like. As we say, math, chemical, engineering, doctors, chemists, Arabic, Islamic history, Islamic religion, you can study whatever you like. Nice space in summer, mashallah, as you can see, too many people, because it's a still mosque here and been extended by the people. By the way, you do the wudu, how do people go to pray? You can drink from fresh water. This comes from a water, spring water, spring water, like it come from the dome. It's a spring water, very beautiful fresh water, and you can you do the wudu here as well. Mashallah. Everybody do the wudu here.